This deck was just stealing cubes. It is a Cerebro 3 agent list, and I've kind of modernized it for the current meta. Now, a lot of things shifted that make this quite a bit better, and I think it feels, it feels very strong. I don't know if I'd say tier one. I don't think it's, there's been enough testing, but it's definitely up there in terms of like its power level and how it fits, at least in the meta that I was seeing today. That, of course, could change quickly because of the patch and how big it was. I'll go over the cards uh, in a sec, but let's look at my personal stats real quick. We played 24 games. Uh, we had one tie, and then we're also one average cube. That's it's pretty good. And we went through multiple iterations. I think this one is the best. We are running Rhino before we had, I think it was Scarlet Witch. We also had a Shang-Chi in here instead of the magic. But the magic feels great. And the power level just felt like I can really kind of contest pretty much any deck also we're running us agent it might be the best use of us agent that i've found so far but he's definitely the worst card in the deck at the same time uh you could drop him for pretty much anything that has three power he might be happier maybe quake because quake can get a lot of surprise cubes ravona is in here because you know she discounts your bro your mystique your iron man um a little bit awkward at times because of bass but i still think you kind of just choose do you want to do one or the other because you could uh you could play ravona down get iron man down on four and then valk that lane um or maybe not but generally bass can kind of make it so you win even if you don't get bro because your bass can hit your iron man and your mystique and you shift from this bro line to this iron man mystique line and it kind of just wins us agent is really good and if you're seeing a lot of tribunal opponents i think a lot of people are actually playing tribunal uh he he counters that he's mostly good for that purpose exactly um, I, I know dara was playing a tribunal deck so there was a decent amount of tribunal out there but again he's very replaceable so i wouldn't like focus on uh on on, on this card at all like don't be sad if you don't have it. The deck might be better with Quake instead or Scarlet Witch or even uh, Shocker. Okay, probably not Shock. I wonder if we even want to bring Invisible Woman back. Oh man, I didn't even think about this because Elioth is kind of gone. So the meta has shifted so much, right? So uh, that, that's why I think this deck's a little bit better. There's a lot less Thanos. When there was Thanos, there was a ton of Reality Stone and Reality Stones were really bad for your magic. But now no one's really playing that. So you kind of get an extra turn. You can almost guarantee your Limbo is going to be there. Give me that extra turn to draw one more card and kind of smooth out your curve so you can maybe play Valk on seven with a two drop or Iron Man on seven with a two drop as well. And then, yeah, just really happy that Eliath is gone um, because everything's less scary. Uh, another one of my favorite things to do is Magic Rhino. Sometimes your opponent just doesn't expect this because why would you ever Rhino your own magic? Uh, but sometimes the stars align and you get a bast you have bro and mystique in your hand you know and then you just uh you you play magic that's gonna have you know three power so we'll get the cerebro buff you play magic on turn five maybe you play bro and then on turn six you go mystique bro or mystique rhino and then you you, you slam the, the the limbo and you just have an insane amount of power everywhere and just win and it's incredibly satisfying and uh your opponent will be sad but you will be happy but yeah one of my favorite decks of all time i'm really happy it's doing well in this current meta and i just could not get enough of playing this one i think it might be better than cerebro 2 uh and i think one of those reasons is it can deal with big things with the valkyrie and also it can deal with locations a little bit better i think you can do you know magic on a lane or rhino on a lane so you can hit two different lanes uh if you're not doing the magic rhino play and yeah fun use of us agents but again uh the worst card in the deck also might be the best us agent deck let's go over some global stats real quick if we look over here um we can see i searched cerebro and valkyrie so it's pretty much narrowing this down to cerebro three and uh no no cerebro three deck is doing that well so maybe it won't do well for you maybe not maybe not in your current pocket meta or maybe people just aren't experimenting enough with cerebro three i also think the deck is kind of hard to play but maybe i'm coping um and then us agent these are all infinite decks with us agent bad card man just not just not good so don't use your spotlight resources on this i was just trying to have a good time with him but yeah he was he was the worst card in the deck nothing's doing too hot with him like these are okay these are doing okay but the snap sizes are so small uh, yeah so don't don't get him basically <laughs> Hope you guys enjoy. Uh, good luck on ladder and stay hydrated. Cheaper because of the new gold feature they added. Live from the Daily Bugle. Kitty.
Do I just get Kitty to three? Damn, they got bird. It's fine. I think I prefer Jeff over Sentinel. Last two weeks of the season have extra gold, so it's the same amount. Uh, people just want to be angry, all right? Just let people be angry and upset. This seems good. And then with final turn, we just use Kitty as a 1-3, I guess. Even though we could have played it and Valked it. A little bit more flexible this way. Do I even want... I might want to throw mid. This might be our Valk lane. To get rid of the Angela. So I think I start putting stuff left instead. Also, what the hell are we playing over here? Aren't we throwing right? Yeah, I guess we have to. Dude, this cat's biting me now. Uh, well, we know they got Kitty, right? And they're gonna keep bouncing Kitty over here. Bro? This and bro? No, we never want a Kitty, actually. Keep that at three power. Two twos. Two twos. We're gonna... On five... We go Sentinel Bro. I don't feel too good about any of this. I'm going to be real. Kind of weird. Okay, they got my shitty deck. This is great. It's good stuff. Okay, that's totally fine. I might not Valk then. Valk can go right. And then Jeff can move, right? If Val goes right, we go Bro, Mystique. Jeff goes right. We have 10 right. No, we have 14 right. Wait, they can't get in here, dude. Everything's discounted. Unless they Jeff right now. I am Iron Man. Yeah, they could have played Iron Man. Iron Man was four. Oh my god, she's literally stepping on my power button. Okay, I'm glad she doesn't have enough weight yet. Ooh. They're gonna move Jeff right. Bird or bear is coming? Nope, they low keep that away. Sorry, Clover's walking around. In range. No way they have bro mystique, man. They can't mystique laugh. Only Iron Man gets affected? Yeah, it's not worth it. It would have been flashy, but what? No, bro. It was close. But no cigar, eh? We got him. I was scared a little bit. How much location disruption there is? Oh god. That really hurts. Okay. What else do we want to hit? Literally nothing with bass, so this is best case. Bass case. <laughs> okay. Um I'm doing mid. Best case scenario, but um, tis. Hey, come on. Shit, dude. Okay, I guess I want to hit those rocks. Rough. Not looking good, man. The fucking rock. We know we don't have Mystique, so might as well do this. They're running Rogue and shit, though. Might just be a Sentinel play. This is our Valk lane if we uh, draw Valk. Rock on Bass lane. Uh, I think we just don't 
this doesn't exist to us. Ah, oh, are they just going to rogue me and win? I'm scared. It feels like overcommitting, but maybe I do it right. What are the odds I draw Valk? They're kind of shit. I am Iron Man. Does he bird? He birds mid. Order in case of Mystique. Mystique is dead. Yeah, maybe Sentinel over Jeff. But if I Jeff right, we win right. Unless they play right, which they will play right. Unless they don't. But we're already adding four if they don't play right. We could do this, even though Mystique's dead. I could play Rock right. For the best off the top not the best the uh the valk off the top it's also possible they don't play the bird and they think i'm gonna play awkwardly because of the possible bird that's a bird but not the bird we were thinking of i think we lose we're adding five mid so they need to add one power mid. We're adding 10 right as Jover. Ravona mid in case they try and rogue. I think I'd rather stop the Iron Man rogue. Actually, no, that's true. If we lose mid, it's actually just Jover. Loft snap? No, no, no. We'll just stick it. We'll stick around. We'll see what happens. He's a net decker? No. Chamo's not a de net decker. A debt necker. I've seen legions a lot today. Legions? I haven't seen a single legion. How much longer have I been streaming? Uh, probably a couple hours. I started a bit late today, so I'll probably run late. All right. They are low rank. They're running a destroy deck. This is kind of gross. If they don't eat right now. They probably eat now. Cosmo every lane. I guess I could. Oh. Okay. I should snap here, but I don't want them to leave. I'm going to wait until it's not fresh in their mind. That they've just been... Just waiting a little bit. Maybe they'll forget about it. Maybe their audio's off. Snap. I know he's blocking all my <laughs> controls. Damn! Cosmo useless? Over committing there. Bro, Mystique has to go mid. Mystique mid? I don't think we... Should we? It's just troll. Do we do it? Ah, it's so funny, actually. But then I can't play this. That's fine. It's actually fine. Alright. Three Cosmos. Damn! Might as well play this, right? This is the hardest lane to win, so I think I do this. I'm gonna have 10. 10 and 10. What are they gonna do? Play death? They stayed? Oh, shit.
I have the magic left. The Jeff left is actually quite good. You need a singular Professor X booster. Good luck. I hope you get it. Why did they play that like that? Mockingbird, it's gotta be, right? I think getting rid of this is, is good. I mean, it helps us, but it might help them more. Any stuff for Valk? No, Valk is pretty key in this deck. Valk is core. Ooh, man. Ooh, man. Turn five? This and a Sentinel. Turn six is Mystique Rhino. We win. It's actually so free, dude. 100% free. Unless... Could they disrupt my power somehow? I don't think so. Oh, okay. Parrot? I got a parrot? Oh, alright. They rogue here? Do I lose here? I need Pryo. We're gonna Rhino laugh. I think this is good. US Agent is better. Oh, better than Sentinel? That's fair. Yeah, I should have played US Agent. Sorry, I'm very distracted by this cat. Um. Rhino left? Mystique right? I would like to win this lane. How do we lose? What does Cerebro do? Oh! The best card in the game. Both Jeff's right. Should I have abandoned mid? If we abandon Crown City, we lose that plus four power. That was good, man. I hear that Windows notification, or is it just me? I have like a volume slider bar, and Seven keeps pushing it with his whole body to maximum volume. Just me? Okay, good. I always get scared. It's like it's incredibly loud. Uh, I don't like the raft. I will probably magic it. They do it the bird though. U.S. Agent won me the scroll duel. Sure. They're gonna bird. I think I Rhino mid later. Okay, glad they didn't get the raft filled out. Okay. See, right now I'm feeling like Shadow King would be super good. This might be a Valk lane. They have the Hawk. Yeah, the Hawk turns off Limbo, but not Bar. Keep the bar and play bro. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Don't know if we want to do that. I'm throwing... Oh, oh shit. They don't have bird in hand anymore. Oh, shit. This is awkward now. Now they could have rhino or magic. How'd I get that Zemo variant? Uh, it was in my shop yesterday. No, you're probably not going to see it right now. Don't play Iron Man right? Oh, he does get hit by the agent as well, right? Oh, is that what that sound is? I was like, what did seven click? God. I, wouldn't do it. I need a Rhino mid. I don't know if they're going to Rhino laugh. I am Iron Man. Wait, there's so much we could do right here. We can copy the man. Juice it up. Then we have to Rhino mid. Edge? Fuck, I did miss it. Copy the man. 
Rhino mid. Cosmo on Limbo. I guess I could just do this and then do this next turn. Or I could bro right Rhino left. I think this wins. I am Iron Man. They might have not gotten Rhino, and this is an insane amount of power. Got him. Because if we blocked the left, it was possible they could have maybe got more power left. Okay. Is fine. Maybe? This might be a Valkyrie next. I should go over the stat. Since Seven's no longer blocking the buttons. I'll put this here for now. You're jealous of my location variants? Well, we do have two location disruptors. Um, but yeah, variants has been good so far. Okay. Cosmo? I could just do this and this into the vault. Do we hate that? I could do it right, because this is going to be easy to beat. And if they play something big, it's probably this lane. Okay, it's huge. Huge. Um, what am I expecting here? I don't know. It's not going great. I guess Iron Man would be good left. Oh. Uh, I think I do this. It wins right, and then Iron Man wins left. Is that the strat? Olsen gave him Enchantress. That would suck. I want to do it this way, too. I don't want to man this turn. Okay, they got my useless deck. This is great. I think this is good. This wins. Agent left. I would rather have more power left, I think. Right. Wait a minute. They move Jeff. They're at 10. They play something like Iron Man. They're at... Oh, but then they get the 3. At 13, they're at 26. This is... No, this is it. You love this song? Okay, good. Pop on. Should I should I change the playlist? We've been playing um, the, the 90s radio. I was doing the 40s radio, but there was too much lotion advertisement. Time for Omar. I am Iron Man. Ooh. Almost. Yeah, this deck feels really good, man. Counters Loki Thumbian, so that's cool. Victory. Especially since we have seven turns. The greed paid off, man. I think I like it left. I could have been even more greedy, but I want to play the magic on three. Yep, that happens every time. How was playing again after so many years? Uh, I didn't play standard. I don't think I really touched standard. But Battlegrounds is fun. It seems good. I probably Rhino here, so I bro Mystique. So it's going to be bro, a bro next turn into Rhino Mystique on the final turn. Snappable? Oh, snap. I draw Iron Man right before playing negative. Yep, every time, dude. I think I should go lower. Oh, wait, this is actually maximum lowness. Maybe I should abandon mid. This would cost two. 
It's better than playing Sentinel, I guess. If they rogue, they'd have to rogue right. Uh, this also lets us... Mystique a different lane. Damn, they're going in on right. We still have priority, that's good. All right. If they rogue, they might hit Vibranium. Wait, I can't play that. Holy shit, imagine. This. If they rogue it, we still win? We're only adding six mid. I don't know if I actually want a Rhino. I feel like I'm overcommitting left. This is risky, dude. This is actually incredibly risky. I feel a little uncomfortable. I think we lost. just be a for fun but i'm at, i'm quite enjoying this this patch right now maybe it's just because cerebro is working but i'm having a lot of fun with snap sometimes yeah snaps in a bit of a lull i'll say it i'll freaking say it man but right now i think it's solid oh This is a Valk lane. Hitting two is good. Don't want to be greedy and wait to hit four. I don't think so. Because we could just play man right if we really want to do that. Okay. Hella? Hella confirmed. Oh, Magic Rhino could have fucked them up. Just go hard on two lanes, I reckon. Is it just a Valk, right? If I have priority, I might try and snipe with the Rhino. If I don't have priority, I Valk. But then I'm forced to Valk. Okay, you know what? I might just leave this mid and see what happens. I think I have Pryo though. Hello! So happy! Don't they just play the big guy, right? I guess they could Hella. If they Hella, they still have the nut. This is seven mid to their three. Valkyrite's risky. It's 28. How big is their big man? Okay, this is scary. Minions to me. Oh no. What is a hit? <laughs> okay. Oh. Victory. I'm sorry. Feels bad. <clears throat> All right, everyone calm down. That was heartbreaking.